Hey guys, how you doing tonight? Thank you for joining us. It's good to see you. Uh, truth be told, we we actually didn't plan on having an upload tonight. We're not going to do our normal Tech Tuesday format and probably won't for a couple of weeks. In fact, our YouTube posts and our social media posts, they'll be at a minimum over the next couple of weeks. Everything's cool. We're just, uh, we're just taking some time to chill out. But I had a customer interaction today that I want to share with you. Jim and Dawn came in from Arizona. They just picked up their 23 from the National Corvette Museum and stopped by here to see us. I want to share that with you, the send-off pad, if you will, and then before we leave tonight, we're going to show off your beautiful rides. All right, how come when I turn the camera on, the wives always go over here? <laughs> Dawn's, oh, Dawn's like, oh no. Jim and Dawn are here from Arizona. But she's not here. And, and what I just realized that we spent a lot of time talking, which I really enjoyed. I love spending the time with you guys. I uh, just took museum delivery of your beautiful 23, rapid blue, tension blue interior. What I didn't ask you guys, how was the museum delivery? We were talking tracking and all kinds and talking oh, yeah. travel, which was a great conversation, but how was the actual delivery experience at the museum? Um, it's actually, it's fantastic. Uh, they assigned a person to us that was with us the entire day. Yeah. They made it so interesting. Yeah. Um, spent time with us in the car, doing some of the settings, showing us how it works, how sure. we do things. Right. Um, and then getting over to um, see the plant which yeah. I know they hadn't done that for five years. He made it really interesting. We kind of hung back in the group and he would tell us little tidbits in between. Oh, cool. Which was really um, Dean. interesting as well. Did you and like it? You like it? Yeah, Dean yeah, did his name was Dean. Oh, did he? Okay. Yeah, and then um, we got back to the museum and actually toured and you're getting that extra information that instead of just reading it on a plaque. Right. He's telling us a little more about- Yeah, great stories there. So, yeah. And, and one of the cool parts, I think, at the very end was when they drive it out through the tunnel. Yes. Um, Don was sitting co-pilot, and I was walking behind the car with my, <laughs> my video. And people are standing um, around, they're clapping. Yeah, yeah. everybody's clapping. Makes nice you feel good. You. And cheers. Yeah. And we were the only one with the, a rapid blue. Right. And every all the tourists were walking up and taking pictures of it, and they're asking her questions while he's trying to tell us what to do with the car. And right. You know, um, it was exciting. It was yeah, you're fun. starting to see this car has that exotic appeal yeah. just in the design, but this color really, really, really makes it jump. And it's hard for me, you guys know, uh, I've been talking about trading my car, what I'm gonna do with the new spec. I got an opportunity now, am I gonna do an anniversary car? I'm gonna make it a multiple choice and we'll make it a contest on the channel for folks. But this one really pulls on my heartstrings. So this is gonna be tough to let this go if in fact I do let it go. So stay tuned, a little promo there for you guys. But. <laughs> I'm so glad that you stopped by because you're into tracking. Um, you have some family up in the Pennsylvania area and you came by here to add the two quarts of fluid to the transmission. Yeah. I so want thanks it. for doing that. Yeah, I want it ready to go and I'm not so sure about the dealers in my area. You gotcha. Know, how they'll treat my car and obviously Chuck knows what he's doing. So we wanted yeah. to, one, come meet you. Appreciate that. Thank no, you that, for that means a lot. Getting really this does. car for us. And, well, I got to uh, thank you for waiting so freaking long. All right, yeah. they're up there waiting. Yeah, I, we didn't even need to talk about it, yeah. but I have to at least acknowledge it because it is still a real thing that we're dealing with in this market. It was never what I intended. There's a lot of stuff that was out of my control from the manufacturer level and some other levels. And you guys have been just very understanding and just awesome to work with. So thank you for that. Thank you. And uh, we're, we're so happy we have, and I'll tell anybody who's waiting for the car right now, it's worth it. Worth the wait. That's what I was waiting for. Yeah, it is. But it really God, is. God, it is. And things are changing because the conversations we're having with folks right now are very different from conversations that we had with you six months to a year ago. It is that ever-changing marketplace. So people need to be understanding. Unfortunately, not everybody is. You guys have been. I'm so glad that you have. I'm glad you're, you're because originally you were going to come in, do some work, leave the car here, fly home, and then ship the car. And now we're That's driving. no fun, man. You're driving it. That's great. I was like, yeah, let's have some fun. Do some adventures. Yeah, 2,700 miles by the time we get home. That's great. And then, so then I know it's full, fully broken in so I can go to the track. You also watched one of my episodes. I talked about track wrap. So uh, Jim's got some track wrap here. It doesn't have to be pretty. It serves a purpose, protected it before it gets home. Jim's like, oh, don't show my car like that, Rick. Please don't. <laughs> it's okay. It's good. No, it's fine. He goes, oh, there's some air bubbles. I'm gonna have to let those out. I said, ah, just leave it. They're fine, not gonna hurt the car. Got that little mesh on the front there that's gonna protect it. Really looks good.
So you've had it for just a short time. What do you like best about it so far? Besides the color and the appeal and how everybody else digs it, what do you like about it? I'll, I'll say the ride. Okay. I was, I've been in other sports cars and this thing is smooth. Yeah. We have the mag ride, you hit some potholes or something, it really absorbs it, yes. but doesn't thump you to death. Right. And the seats are super comfortable. We're, we're on the twos instead yes. of the yeah, you track. GT, ones, yeah, I got yeah. the GT twos. Although and, you and I would love the track seats, and I wish there was a quick release for those. But for right. everyday driving, no, they just don't work. But these are the most comfortable yeah, seats. Yeah, super comfortable. And right. She's really comfortable, and Absolutely. not a lot of road noise either. Yeah. It's very quiet. It's, oh, it's yeah. really not that loud. So, is it okay if I open your door real quick? I want to show the okay. folks the. Um, the stealth interior package. I never got a chance yeah. to kind of make my disclaimer. We talked about this back in April and I was really upset the way that it looked. And I actually reached out to somebody on the Corvette team because originally this was a light gray. This, well, you've got the carbon fiber. This was different here. This was different. And they said that they were still doing some evaluations. They did make some changes. I don't know if we had anything to do with that, but thank you, GM. Much nicer job on the stealth package. Now it looks like stealth. This looks good. Oh, I like the carbon fiber too. And of course, I love this interior. Wow, that looks fantastic. Oh, you know what I got to do too? I got to get a picture of your nameplate. Oh, we, in the center. Yeah. yeah, we haven't shared that yet. Uh, we'll talk more about that in another video, but I want to get all those nameplates up there, those custom badges you had, and they're pretty neat. And nobody yet has done the one I said that you could do, although someone almost did, that I love tacos. It's raining tacos. <laughs> <laughs> you can put anything you want on there. Yeah, you can. Yeah, see what you guys got in there. Join my age, I had to ask him. I said, so, uh, Jim, what does it say? What does it say? Rapid Blue and Fast 2. Yeah, I couldn't see it without my glasses. Rapid Blue and Fast 2, I love it. Okay, we're going to do a send-off, Pat. I want to hop in the car with him. I know the museum does a great job at delivery, showing you the stuff, as Jim was just talking about, but I still want to make sure that you're comfortable with the settings of the features and any questions that, you know, once you're in the car, that's an emotional day. Sometimes you forget half of what he said. It's like, what? What did you say? Oh, forget it. I'll, fi I'll figure it out later. Yeah. <laughs> but now's, a, now's later, and maybe I can help you just get re-familiar with some of those buttons and uh, get you ready to roll back home to Arizona. That'd be great. All right, fantastic. Aren't they cool? You guys are cool. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching the channel, for your support, and your business opportunities as well. Great to meet you guys. Thanks for the support. Thanks for the business. Thanks for hanging in there, man. Really appreciate it. Uh, you too, man. Now I get to do the send-off, Pat. I didn't get a chance to go to the museum to see you, but I'm glad you came by. Seriously. Absolutely. Maybe I'll see you at the track, too. Hopefully. Yeah, send us some footage so we can share it. See how you're doing. Make sure you go to Spring Mountain. I'm going. Don, make sure you go if you can go with them. Yeah. All right. They are awesome. Going back to Arizona from Ohio from the museum delivery. They're 23. We got Dawn and Jim a send-off, Pat. Yeah. And the high wing, we're going to rub it. <laughs> yes. Thanks, you guys. I appreciate it. You too, man. And Jim and Dawn, thank you again. It was wonderful to meet you guys in person. Congratulations on your new car. And thank you so much for your support and your understanding in a process that went uh, much much too long in my opinion. You got your car now though, and I'm glad you're out there driving it and enjoying it. And for those that have been contacting us today about new order allocations, remember allocations are released once a month in the middle of the month, not on the first of the month. <laughs> now they had a great looking car, so let's show off some more. These are your beautiful rides. Hi, it's April from South Carolina, and you're watching Rick Conti's Corvette channel. Hey, thank you, April. I appreciate that.
inside is bleeding Oh, and your heart's bleeding And all you can see is red Till you discover It is within each other To forgive and make amends If I had known then Or oh, I'd have known now I wouldn't have said what I said I took the long road Thought I'd be better on my own Sometimes what's right is wrong instead And that you are the one. 